First off, before moving forward, I want to send all of my best thoughts and wishes to Damar Hamlin. For context, he plays safety on the Buffalo Bills. He's only 24 years old and collapsed on the field in tonight's game where the Bills took on the Cincinnati Bengals. Before showing it, I am issuing a content warning as the following footage is graphic and I'll only be showing it once. As you see, after getting back up, he collapsed and needed to be given CPR for nine straight minutes before getting transferred to the local hospital. At the time that I'm recording this, Hamlin was intubated and is currently listed as being in critical condition. After taking way too long to decide what to do, the league suspended play for the rest of the game. The players were stunned, crying, as any normal human would be. Now, let's talk about some of the reactions going around. And that starts with these inexcusable words by Skip Bayless. You don't really even need to be a regular casual football fan to have heard of Bayless's antics, and it continues with his tweet that he posted tonight. In case you're not too familiar with him, however, he does work for Fox Sports, and you can regularly find him on TV from 9.30 to 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on their network. This is what he had to say. No doubt the NFL is considering postponing the rest of this game, but how? This late in the season, a game of this magnitude is crucial to the regular season outcome, which suddenly seems so irrelevant. See, he added those last five words thinking it would save face, but uh, it really didn't. It took him 52 minutes to write a follow-up to this, and it's obviously, it got ratioed hard on Twitter, as it's very insensitive to Hamlin's family, friends, teammates, the fans of the sport. In his next tweet that he posts, he states, Nothing is more important than that young man's health. That was the point of my last tweet. I'm sorry if that was misunderstood, but his health is all that matters. Again, everything else is irrelevant. I prayed for him and will continue to. Now, media personalities like Kendrick Perkins, huge people within the game, have responded by saying, you're a sick individual, real talk. And thousands of replies are in similar nature, whether it's from the media or the fans. And it's clear. This is not okay and does not belong in sports broadcasting or journalism. This is all I have to say and again, I'm ending this off wishing my absolute best to Hamlin and I hope when most people see this video and are watching it at this moment that he's recovering and has made it through. Stay safe everyone.